How's it going? Yeah, good man. Good. Just a cruisy 4K this morning. Keep it cruisy just to finish off our deload week. Nice. Oh. Running gets you so tight. Just have a good stretch after this. <laughs> oh, what are we doing after this? Uh, we're gonna go, go down to the gym and we're gonna do what open test workout. So we're just gonna test out, like just get back in the spirit of competing again and get the camera out and Send it. Good man. Good. Just gonna vibe out. A lot of reps. Hey. A lot of reps to get done. Yeah, it's alright. It's alright. That'll be crazy. That'll be crazy. Yeah. Just gotta keep going. 14 minutes. Want to peak at the 10 minute mark?
But so if there's a light inside of us, it shows the way. Not looking for no, no, no. that it's only three weeks so it's just a lot smaller and, and we've got heaps of people doing it from the gym so I'm just I'm really pumped for just the community side of it and yeah. to be able to just get in there with everyone and be surrounded by you know people I train every day and people I'm surrounded by and, and just the community it's gonna be awesome I can't wait. What's the deal with the structure of the Open this year? Yeah so the structure of the Open it's uh, three weeks long uh, we'll do a workout which needs to be filmed you send that in online and then you'll get scored on a leaderboard um, it's top 10%, so if 10,000 people sign up, you just need to come top 1,000, so I'm pretty confident in doing that. And then there's going to be a quarterfinals weekend, which is uh, going to be the for the top 10% that make it. You need to place top 30 in Australia and New Zealand. So that's the one where we're like, okay, we're going to fire off that, that's what I'm going to peak to, almost. And depending on how the Open goes, I'll delay the peak to Torian Pro, if uh, I'm feeling pretty confident to get top 30. Um, but yeah, this year is, um, I'm just really excited and, and trying to stay relaxed as possible and stress free and, and just really trying to soak it up and en enjoy it as much as I can. Yeah. yeah. Can you get back on a, on a competition floor? I'm so keen. For what, almost two years now? Oh, well, I competed last time at, uh, at Oz CrossFit Chance, which is in March last year, just before COVID. Yeah. And we placed third on the team there, so we're actually one spot away from qualifying for the, the games in a team. So, um, so I've got a feeling uh, from down under where I placed 20th, I sort of upped the level going into the uh, Oz Chance team competition. And then in COVID, we train like a motherfucker. And I can just tell, just uh, I've got a really good feeling about this year and just, uh, and just ready to just put it all out on the line on the competition floor. And, and because it's been a while, like, I'm just excited to, to, I'm almost like, I just really want to get out there. I want to show what I've been doing and all the work I've been putting in, all the days I've been in here alone and, and just all the hard days I've got through. So, uh, back to individuals then? Back to individual, man, yeah. Game plan is to the games, to the games here on out, up and, up and onward. Any predictions for the first workout of the Open? Yeah, the first workout of the Open, I've got a feeling that uh, it's going to be like low skill, um, who knows, it might be longer or like a 10 to 20 minute window, maybe a dumbbell, something like that. 
I don't know, you never know. Whatever it is, uh, we'll be ready, we'll have fun. Yeah. Yeah, thanks, Rookie. Uh, see you soon. Done.